Tessa Wallace. And this is Lazy Eats. We did two combinations. We did a chocolate covered strawberry as well as a red velvet cupcake. While we're making the red velvet cupcakes, we're going to show you the process on breaking it down on step by step because not a lot of people know that a red velvet cupcake is actually a chocolate cake with a lot of red food dye. Now when we put it all together and we're going to shift the flour, the sugar, and the salt, uh, we do that to make sure there's no clumps or any type of sugar crystallization. So we try to make sure we keep all the cupcakes about the same height and that's the easiest way to do it is by measuring out using the scoop to help us keep that formulation of the cupcakes so when we did put them in the oven and bake them up we try to rotate because we use a convection oven a convection oven uses pan to circulate the heat inside we want to make sure we rotate our product in there so it doesn't kind of all push to one side and we had our red velvet cupcakes with a cream cheese frosting that pairs really well with it fill up the pie bag as much as possible and we do a circular pattern going up so we're ma actually making kind of like a, a poop emoji everybody likes that one uh, but it's actually a spiral with a point uh, that way it looks in like a cloud on top of our cupcake for this you will set up a double broiler which is just a pot with water and a metal bowl over top the double broiler is great to hold back the heat that we don't need if we get too hot we can pull the bowl off any given time Tessa Wallace. And thanks for watching Blaze Eats. Go Blaze. Go Blaze.